Basel World, the watch industry's biggest trade fair, opens in Switzerland. And as Haley Platt reports, years of double-digit growth have come to an end. We are all finished. Titan Black only sells 100 watches a year, but they're no ordinary timepieces. The company specializes in customizing some of the biggest brands, including Cartier, Patek Philippe and Rolex. It's a trend that has helped keep the luxury watch market ticking over, despite a tough climate. Luke Waite is the MD. We'll work with you to essentially customize to your heart's content. I mean, it, the, the limit, the, there is no limitation. And typically, it started around two thousand pounds and and can go up to um, sort of twenty five thousand, something something in that region. In recent years, the Swiss watch industry has seen double digit growth, and last year's exports still hit an all time high. But they were only one point nine percent higher than the previous year, and that was a shock to many. Overall, the sector grew in 2013 by 5.7%, despite a slowdown in other high-end sectors. Global demand last year was once again fuelled by brick markets, with the highest year-to-year -year increases in China, Russia and India. Only Brazil bucked the brick trend. Established markets such as Germany, the US and Japan all saw a decline, although demand was up in Italy and the UK. China is still the biggest consumer of luxury watches, but its economy is slowing and the government is trying to move away from conspicuous spending. Hublot's chairman is Jean-Claude Bivet. At the end of the day, with wealth, people are changing their uh, consumer habits. With wealth, the Chinese are even starting to eat now yogurt. They start to eat cheese. So wealth makes changes and with wealth, people will start buying uh, 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 the Swiss-made luxury watches again. A number of brands are considering cutting prices, and Hublot is also hoping for a World Cup boost. It's the official watchmaker for Brazil. When you imagine the World Cup is the uh, biggest uh, TV event with uh, 36, 38 billion people watching, um, we expect uh, a boost all over the world, but of course also in uh, Brazil. Some are predicting a return to timeless and classical watches. Bling, they say, is out. That won't worry Titan Black. They make something that's unique, and that's a trend expected to survive the test of time.